Hello everybody and welcome back to my channel. I just wanted to say hello to all of you. I haven't seen you in maybe about a week and a half now and it's all because of this stinker right here. But isn't he so cute? He's just the cutest, cutest little puppy I've ever seen. Oh, you chubby puppy. Oh, you little chubby puppy. I have been on pup paternity leave for the last week and a bit because this guy is just such a handful. He's seriously more work than like a baby. A baby at least, you know, doesn't run around the yard, bite plants that should not be ingested and swallowing rocks, you know, and picking up wood and having a splinter in his mouth and everything like that. So this guy has to be monitored, monitored all the time and he's still not housebroken. You know, it's gonna take for a while for him to be completely potty trained and whatnot. Um, but yeah, so he's just such a handful and I really, really needed that week to kind of get him used to the house, you know, kind of acclimatize him with Muffin a little bit, you know. Muffin has been really, really good. Um, Muffin has not even hissed at the dog yet. Muffin just kind of sits by his pen. I have a kind of a metal pen where I leave him, um, with a tarp. So just in case he does, you know, kind of pee or poo or something accidentally, it's not a big deal. It's not going to get on any carpet or any hardwood. Um, yes. Yes, oh, you little bed shark. Are you bed shark? Are you bed shark? What's this? What's this? Oh, you bed shark. I love when he does that. I was calling him Dante for, uh, for a while there, but then all of a sudden my family and it was like, why would you call him something so, so closely related to the devil? And I'm like, oh, calm down. It's just like story, like it's not a big deal. But I kind of, I kind of found that Dante was a little cold sounding and he is so cute. He's kind of like a teddy bear. Oh, hi, Muffin. Muffin's just like walking around here. He's like, what are you guys doing? <laughs> He's so cute. Had a lot of migraines the last couple days, more so than I normally do have. I think I had about maybe four migraines in one week, which was quite a lot to deal with, um, especially having a newborn puppy and stuff in the house, you know, and a cat and trying to like separate and adjust the two together. Um, so it's been quite the handful. And then of course, you know, normal life, normal work and all that kind of stuff, balancing all this. The peas and the poos have been really hard, especially at night. It's okay during the day, because I take them out as often as I can. But at nighttime, you know, you gotta take them out at one o'clock, three o'clock, five o'clock. Sometimes he won't poo, sometimes he won't pee. It seriously makes Muffin look like a little self, uh, self cleaning, self feeding little Tamagotchi pet over there. I don't have to do any work with him. He always smells good, grooms himself. You know, he's always peeing and pooing in the same spot. Muffin is just like no work. It really did make me appreciate how much uh, not work muffin was so i'm hoping to kind of lighten the load for muffin in terms of my torture and my videos and stuff so this guy can kind of share on some of the load so this guy is super super smart he's already learned sit um high five shake and lay down and he's pretty good at you know doing number one and number two on command when i say his little thing so he is getting so much better um hey 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 what are you doing shake Oh, you can bite me though, shake, not bite. Oh, and he's like teething right now and he's biting everything. He's like biting things he shouldn't, biting me. And I have like cuts and like bite marks all over my body. So whenever he bites me now, I go like, ah, ah. And I try to make like the most annoying sound ever so he stops doing it. So thank you guys so much for sticking around. I'm so, so sorry again for not posting, but this guy was just such a handful and I really wanted to give this little puppy, you know, all my undivided attention because he really did deserve it. I mean, he got taken away from his mom and siblings, you know, a long like eight hour road trip away from his family and a ferry ride. So I, I thought he really deserved to, you know, have like the best kind of care, love and attention right now. So I'm super excited to be back and I will be uploading again, probably like every second day or so. And I do have some live streams with a couple of people that I have been kind of coordinating. So be sure to look out for those live stream announcements soon. I'm super excited. I haven't done any live streaming stuff before. So it'll be really, really fun. So please remember to like, comment, and subscribe. I come with new videos every week, uh, except the last week because of this guy. Come check me out on social media and help support the channel on Patreon. So thank you guys so much for watching and stay legendary.